Hey guys, today we're going to talk about what is the median. So the first thing we need is some data and uh, I'm just going to make up some data and uh, so this data uh, is made up of a group of numbers so let's say I have 3, 7, 11, 21, 33. So this is our set of data and this data could represent anything. It could be for example if I had five people this could be their age uh, so uh, or it could be the amount of money they have in their pockets um, it could represent anything we don't care about what it represents right now we just want to find out what the median is now the median is simply the number that is in the middle after you put them in ascending order so you can see that the numbers are in order from smallest to largest and I have the number 11 is in the middle so this number here is called the median so basically the median is simply what number is in the middle so if I give you a group of numbers if I say uh, I now have 7, 21, 5, 0, 1, 3, 2 so what number is in the median? Well, the first thing you have to do, step one, is to put the numbers in order. So put the numbers in order from smallest to largest. Alright, if you don't do that, then you will be doing it incorrectly so uh, the numbers from smallest to largest well we have 0 is the smallest and then we have 1 2 3 7 oops sorry we had 5 there 5 7 and 21 so now I have put the numbers in ascending order from smallest to largest and then we can pick which number is in the middle now if you want to do it you, without using any uh, sort of maths what you can do is uh, so step two find out which number is in the middle is in the middle and what you can do is uh, simply cross out one number at a time from each end so I'm gonna cross out one number at a time uh, until I get to the middle number which is 3 so 3 the median is equal to 3 okay now in another situation what if I had two numbers in the middle so for example uh, I'm gonna put in the same data set as before but now I'm gonna add another piece of data and now let's see which number is in the middle so let's cross out one number at a time and now we have two numbers that are in the middle so what happens is you need to find the midpoint of these two numbers so the median is therefore halfway between three and five and how you find that is you're going to add them together so 3 plus 5 add them together and then divide it by 2 so that's 8 divided by 2 which is 4 so the median is equal to 4 okay so now what happens if I give you a really long set of numbers okay I'm now gonna give you one 
I'm gonna put them in order for you straight away so it's easier. Okay, so you can see that we have quite a few numbers here. And now, uh, you can cross out one number at a time from each end to find the median, but that's going to take you a long time. So the first thing we're going to do is count how many numbers there are. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. There are 18 numbers. And we're going to represent that using the symbol n. n equals 18. So n represents how many numbers there are in your data set. Okay, now we're going to find the position of the median. Position of the median. And that simply represents where is the median located in this set of numbers. So in order to find that, we're going to use the formula n plus 1 divided by 2. So this formula here has nothing to do with uh, what we used just before, right? 3 plus 5 divided by 2, this formula here uh, was used to find the midway midpoint between two numbers. Right now here, what we're trying to find is the position of the median so where is the median located in our data set? So we're going to go n is 18. So we have 18 plus 1 divided by 2, which is 19 divided by 2, which is uh, uh, 9.5. So what does 9.5 represent? Is 9.5 the median? No, it's definitely not the median. So we're going to start counting from the beginning to the 9.5th position. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 9.5. So this right here is where our median is located. Right, right here. So the median is halfway is uh, halfway between 7 and 9. So we're going to add them together, divided by 2. So that's uh, 16 divided by 2, which is 8. So the median is 8. Okay, I hope uh, you guys uh, now have a better understanding of how to find the median from a group of numbers. Thanks for watching. See you next time.